Good morning, everyone. I'm Storm Surge 7 Chief Meteorologist Steve Kirsch doing a video forecast this morning because, believe it or not, we have a chance of snow. Not for today, but perhaps for this time tomorrow morning, mainly across eastern New Mexico and the southwestern Texas Panhandle. We have an upper-level storm system making its way from the El Paso area toward Midland, Odessa. And when that happens about this time tomorrow morning, the storm may be close enough to us to throw a little bit of light snow our way. Now, snowfall totals will be light, less than an inch. In the case of Amarillo, maybe just a dusting, and we might be lucky to get that. But if you live in Clovis, Portales, maybe down toward Friona, Dimmit, uh, anywhere in the southwestern uh, Texas panhandle, eastern New Mexico, you may get a half inch, maybe an inch if you're lucky. Let's take a look at the computer model data this morning, and we're going to run this through about the next uh, 36 hours. And I want you to note something. The, the storm system, you can see it developing in the southwestern Texas panhandle. And notice this area of snow and just how close it gets to the high plains. Amarillo is right here where my uh, little cursor is located. It'll stop this tomorrow morning. So here we are here, but if you live down around Clovis, you've got some light snow falling. Now notice how patchy it is. It's not anywhere near as concentrated as it is closer to the center of the upper level low down in the Big Bend region of Texas, but close enough and with enough moisture around that perhaps something could happen. And that's the reason for this video forecast. Let me show you what our computer model data is showing because again, this is going to be tomorrow morning or tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. And you notice it has some snow in southern Quay County over Curry County, parts of Roosevelt County, getting into Parmer, Castros, even Swisher and Briscoe County has some light snow. Even Amarillo could see something. And again, less than an inch, maybe even less than a half inch of snow. But if you live north of I-40 or specifically north of the Canadian River, you may not see anything at all. This storm is just going to be too far to your south to really do much. But tomorrow is going to be a cold day, so will today. I have a lot more coming up on daybreak from 5 to 7 a.m. this morning. I'll also be back for Pro News 7 midday at 11 to update you on these very slight snow chances for just part of the High Plains for your TGI Friday. Have a fantastic day. We'll talk to you later.